Okay. So I got a bone to pick with you, Reese. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yeah. What did you do earlier today? Hmm? Is it harder than you're going to think about it? A little fresh memory? Who got in the trash? Who pulled out one pound? You and your sister both. We have So I have a German Shepherd and a wiener dog. This is Reese. And he's in big trouble. So tell... Tell everybody what you did. No, as a matter of fact, I'll tell everybody what you did. Okay? So him and his sister like to either go in the trash or if we leave meat on the front counter to de Oh, what well, is this boring you? I'm sorry, we, is this boring? Uh, okay, that's inappropriate. Anyways, we left one pound of turkey <clears throat> on the counter to de Yeah. Yeah, we did. <laughs> and Luna, who is 70 pounds... Decided to jump on top of the counter, pull off. Where are you going? You got somewhere to go? You got a hot date? Yeah, I didn't think so. Hey, pay, pay attention, you. You're on camera. Yeah, act professional. So, this big girl took down one pound of turkey, dragged it from the kitchen. Mind you, we have carpet. All the way from the kitchen... All the way to our bedroom. And they decided to have breakfast in bed. Raw meat. Yeah. Raw meat. They ate the, the whole thing. They ate the whole thing of ground turkey. Raw. Now what do you have to say for yourself? I put their asses in time out. Yeah. So what do you got to say for yourself? figures life of a dachshund okay anyways hey so that's not <clears throat> that's not the whole reason why i was doing this video so <sighs> moving again we're moving again uh this time it's for good uh we're not going anywhere this time we're not pcsing i'm actually getting medically discharged uh well medically retired actually from the army which is good news um uh, we are moving to Arkansas, where my family is. We're going to buy a house there, and we're going to just celebrate, have many Christmases, and then uh, different things with family, and it's a, we're starting a new chapter in our life. So that being said, um, I'm going to have a new studio. This is like going to be a legit studio. Like I'm adding TVs, I'm going to put a TV on the wall. I might even get a freaking projector. They have an 85 inch I yeah 85 inch projector I think it actually goes up to 100 or something like that and it's like 4k I'm thinking about maybe getting on that level but um yeah so um yeah it's gonna be a new studio new equipment with uh hopefully some new guests and stuff but you know once again I, you know when I was here and when I'm here in Georgia I've already kind of established myself in this this area in Richmond Hill and I, I know the area, I know people, I know the small business that I've, uh, that I've interviewed and, and talked to. And so I've kind of made a little footprint here for myself and my wife. So now i got to start all over again. Um, all over again in, in Arkansas, in our little town called Jonesboro. <clears throat> well, it was a little town, now it's not. It's freaking huge. So, uh, so i got to start all over again. Um, I'm going to be going to school there. I'm going to be finishing up at uh, ASU, Arkansas State University. Uh, home of the Red Wolves. And um, that's where I'm going to learn how to talk to people and market and uh, get my feet wet in the area uh, and um, just getting to know new people and just, you know, make my business grow. I, that's all I wish for. That's all I hope for or pray for is just my, my business to succeed and and I meet new people and uh, get new ideas for the show because right now um, I'm working on a couple of different things that I want to do with it and it's it's going pretty well. Um, I'm actually kind of happy with the way the show is going. Where are you going, Reese? Hmm? You, do, you, do you know where you're at right now? Yeah, I'm doing a whole show with my dog in the guest chair. He just helped himself. But um, what was I talking about? <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, I got some uh, new ideas for the show. Um, 
you know, which direction I wanted to go, you know, cause I was actually kind of like, like I said, I'm very, I was very proud of myself with how things have gone so far, you know, cause I'm, I mean, I'm not as big as anybody yet and, or am I now, but it's growing and I'm very, very pleased with it. Cause I remember, you know, when I first started this back in July of last year, I may have said this on the podcast before, but you know, I was, um, I mean, I would have two to three views a month, you know, and I was about ready to throw a towel in. And then I started noticing different social media media platforms that could help me make my business grow. Definitely Facebook, you know, they've helped me a lot. Um, yes, you have to put in a lot more than you're going to receive. You're probably not going to get anything at all like me, but uh, I mean, it's worth it. And I am... Um, I've grown to one, you know, some videos have 175 to over 200 views. So, I mean, I mean, that's great. I mean, I'm, I'm happy with that. You know, I want, of course I want to grow, but you know, from where I came from, that's definitely an improvement. Sorry for breathing really hard. I'm kind of fat and I just went for a four mile hike. That fucking killed me and my feet hurt and I have done that in a while. I had 25 pounds on my back. Yeah, but um, yeah. So, give a shout out to the Ink and I. The Ink and I uh, made two shirts for me. Um, their their fabric with the where the where they get their t shirts from. It's so comfortable. I mean, every time I put on a t shirt, it makes me look good. It, it feels good, you know, because I like the. It's not the shirts that stick to your body, you know, that, like, you have to, like, kind of stretch out, and, you know, like, it's just, like, stuck, you know, like, spandex for your stomach, so, no, they feel good, and with the equipment that they use is all up-to-date, they use the software is up-to-date, and it's really cool how they do it. Um, actually, t- I want to take a trip down to their studio and see how they do it, I'm going to do uh, a little podcast there, do a little show with them, I just, I'm waiting on some equipment to uh, come in so I can do that, it's going to be, like, a little on-the-road podcast. Gay, but no, it's gonna be cool. Um, once again, I haven't even talked about that yet, but I'm sure they'll be down for it. They have two locations one is in South Carolina, and one is, I think, in, they told me in Richmond Hill. Yeah, it's in Richmond Hill. And uh, if you want to, if you want to follow them on Facebook, do it. It's the Ink and I, and it's, they're on Facebook. It's, um, uh, oh God, I'm blanking on their name Anthony and Kendall. Uh, get a hold of them, message them. Uh, they're very, the prices are great. Uh, it's very reasonable. Um, I'm actually getting five polos in, business professional polos that are going to look through the roof, and that's going to look great. I'm really excited about that. Um, they're working on that now. Um, it should be coming in any day. And, okay, so another guy, uh, Paul Boyd. Uh, I need to have this guy in the show. He's, I love talking to this guy. He has so many awesome stories to tell. Cause he's a, he, he, for his main job, he's an air traffic controller and he, I mean, that job is pretty badass in itself, you know? So, but he's, he's got a lot of like cool stories to, to talk about and share. He's been doing it for a while. And so anyway, so I need to get him back on the show. Um, so Paul, if you're listening, give me a call. Um, so <clears throat> what he does on the side though, he does, uh, website development and he helped actually help me. Uh, develop mine, which I'm still working on because I am, uh, uh, it's just, it's so complicated. I'm slowly learning how to like even upload videos onto my, my, uh, website, but it's going to be up soon. I'm still working hard on it. Um, but anyways, back to him. So he has been doing it for a while. He's all self-taught. So he, um, I keep forgetting what he uses. I think I wrote it down here. Hold on. Give me a second. Oh my goodness! I think I'm gonna have to write it out. But anyway, so uh, he's self-taught. He's he what he his customer service is through the roof. He, you know, when you ask him, well, he he asks you what you want on your your website. He asked you like questions like, so what what do you want for your? Is it like small business? Like what are you selling? Or if you're promoting something, what do you, how do you want it to look? And they have his website has number of, font, of of different 
uh, website de- designs and everything that you can go, you scroll through and you just click on one and send it to him. You're like, okay, cool. I'll get it set up and you will know, talk about pricing. Um, and uh, if you want to contact him, it is contact at teamwireframe.com. Uh, again, that is contact at teamwireframe.com. And he will be happy to help you out. He's a good guy. I like I like him a lot. I've known I've known Paul since the second grade. I've known him, oh, good lord, oh, twenty years I think. Holy crap! It's nah, it's been that long. I don't have to. It's that's no. I'm thirty one now. That I, I can't do the math. But yeah, I've known him for a long time. He's a great guy. Um, yeah. So just be looking forward to more. Uh, podcast. I'm trying to get more people in the studio um, and to um, do different things with the studio or with the show. And yeah. So if you guys want to say goodbye to my wiener dog, say bye, Reese. 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 Yeah, I'm talking to you. Pay attention. Yeah. Anyways, y'all have a good day. Um, I'm your host from Will That Suck Podcast. Uh, stay tuned. More to come. Stay cool, guys. Oh, shit. I keep doing this. Email me if you have any questions. I just had a band uh, email me not too long ago that they wanted me to put some of their music up. I, if you listen to that podcast, it's uh, like No Tomorrow. Uh, go listen to them. Their EP is up on their Facebook um, website or page. Um, go give them a like and, and uh, tell them you like them. Again, that's like No Tomorrow. They're a punk band out of Virginia. Um, if you want to email me with stuff like that, if you guys are making music that you want me to put up on the website or up on my, uh, my show, I would love to do it. I love promoting music, anything. Uh, if you have any questions about my show, uh, go ahead, email me at well, that suck podcast at yahoo.com. Once again, that is well, that sucked at, or well, that sucked podcast, right? I'm saying this right. Yeah. Well, that sucked podcast at yahoo.com. Okay. Cool guys.